Okay, uh, last but not least, uh, we're ready to build the aircraft. Um, so uh, we're going to jump right into it. We have our target files that we copied, along with our uh, right and left night textures. So we'll start with the first target, this is the belly. We're going to open it with the DXT bitmap. Oops, wrong program. There we go. DXT bitmap. File. Save as. Extended bitmap. You can either save it at 32 or DXT3, depending on what you want to do. I always do 32. It's a bigger file size, but in my opinion, it looks a lot better. So we're done with that one. Open with. DXT. File. Save as. Extended bitmap. 32 bit. I forgot. We got to get rid of the KLM. I didn't do that on the last one. So we'll. So that's gone. Uh, let me uh, let's fix this one. We'll get rid of the KLM on the bitmap that we just created. There we go. Uh, fuselage left. I'll save as extended bitmap 32. Get rid of KLM. Goodbye. Yes. You can actually uh, open it within that program, but I'll just use this one. It's easier just to go this way. File, save as, extended bitmap, 32, goodbye, KLM. Wing left and wing right. It's real monotonous. Like I said, you have to have patience to be able to do this. Almost done. All right. So we're done with all that. Everything's saved. Now we go to this, our left and right night textures that we created earlier. As you see, the uh, fuselage left. It should be. The file name B763 fuse underscore left underscore L. So we'll copy that. We'll just get rid of this texture altogether. Go to our left one and we'll paste that name in there. So now we got our left texture and now we'll do the same for the right. Get rid of the original right texture. Go to our right texture. Change the name. And we're done. So the aircraft is uh, ready to be viewed within flight sim. So uh, go to your aircraft configuration, aircraft config, and bring it up to where it's all within the f viewing frame here. Uh, last one I have in there, this happens to be an American Airlines jet. So you're going to copy your very last flight sim entry, paste it in there change this to the very next sequence number. That one was 13, so this one will be 14. Level D simulation 763ER dash. Put your airline here. KLM Gary. Texture. This is whatever we named our texture folder. We named it texture.klmgary. So everything after the dot goes here. KLM Gary. Tell number here under ATC ID so it's PH BZI airline airline name what the call sign is KLM and the last but not least UI variation it's gonna be KLM Gary this is how it'll show up in the uh, flight simulator menu so don't mess with the sim entry don't mess with the model unless it's going to be a Pratt and Whitney or a uh, Rolls Royce. So file, save that, close it, and uh, now we're ready to uh, to view our creation within Flight Simulator. So uh, we'll go ahead and open up Flight Sim.
it does take a minute to load while we're waiting on that um, I just want to thank everyone who uh, has downloaded these video tutorials and sat through all 12 of them um, uh, you know it, it means a lot to us that y'all enjoy our aircraft and you're able you know you're able to go out there and you know simulate flying the real thing and uh, you know it brings us joy to see you enjoying it basically um, here we go uh, we're gonna go in to select our aircraft level D simulations 763ER gonna change it down to KLM Gary if you did it all correctly it should show up here and there it is there's our paint job that we just did not too shabby so uh, we'll go ahead and select it and uh, with it loaded we'll go to uh, Oman it's way over in the desert and it loads super super fast not so super fast when uh, I have the uh, recording software going apparently anyways so we'll go to our outside view and there it is a completed 767 painted by you it really wasn't that hard was it uh, in future tutorials uh, what we'll do We'll go over uh, adding the winglets to the aircraft because by the time you watch this the winglet model will be out. Uh, we'll go over how to add winglets and um, we will also go over um, how to convert one of these paints over to Flight Simulator X, Flight Simulator 10. So um, again thank you, uh, thank you for downloading. Uh, thank you uh, you know for for watching and I hope you enjoy these tutorials and hopefully it'll make you a better painter and um, if you have any suggestions or anything feel free to pop in our forum uh, we're soon gonna have a repaint forum uh, which is hopefully where this will be at and uh, just pop in there and say hey you know I, that one thing you did I got a way of doing it better you know and and share your suggestions so others can learn from what you do so uh, thank you and uh, Good flying.